For most schools, the lacrosse season starts in the spring, but for the Ravenscroft Ravens, their season starts a little bit earlier. Ever since late September, the men's varsity lacrosse team has had preseason workouts. We had a chance to sit down with assistant coach Daniel Resner to see what he thought about starting so early. In a couple weeks, we'll be starting out with our on-field workouts. Uh, despite the cold and wet weather that we get sometimes, we always try to push through because it's a great way for our guys to get ready for the season. Uh, we get a lot of work done during that time. We put in offense, we put in defense, uh, skill work, and um, once again, it also helps the younger players and the older players get together as a group, uh, build some team chemistry and cohesiveness, and uh, we really enjoy it as well. We have a little fun with it too, so uh, it's a great thing to do. I think we're one of the few teams that does that so early on, and uh, definitely it's helped us be successful in the past, and we hope for it to continue to do so in the future. Not only do the Ravens work hard out on the field, but they also put in long afternoons in the weight room, working on their strength and conditioning. We were able to catch up with senior midfielder Robert Cooley and see how he thought the preseason workouts have helped the team. Yeah, so starting workouts early gives us a leg up on the competition because uh, we're used to playing lacrosse starting in November. Um, we're not rusty in March when we play some really important games. Uh, last year, we made it to the finals and we started practicing really early last year too. So. I think that really helped, and this year we're trying to do better, trying to win the state championship. Um, hit that repeat. No, wait, no, not repeat. The Ravens finished their 2015 season with a 15-2 and record and were the state championship runners-up. We spoke with head coach Sandy Cavatos and were able to get his thoughts and hopes for the upcoming 2016 season. I think we're very optimistic about this coming season. Um, we're state finalists. We have the majority of the team back. Um, we graduated a few people on the defensive end of the field, a couple of attackmen. Uh, we're going to move some people around to replace and fill those holes. But other than that, again, as I, as I first said, we have the remainder of the team coming back. Um, so they're familiar with the philosophy. We're not going to change much. And the things that we do, uh, hopefully we're just going to get better at the things that we do. Uh, there'll be some, as I mentioned, some holes to fill and some new, some new roles to fill for people. But I think, um, I think we have a mature enough group to be able to accomplish that. Like Coach Capitos said, he's been moving around players to new positions. So we spoke with senior defenseman Stratton Lindenmuth to see how the preseason workouts have helped him with his transition from midfield to defense? Well, starting so early has helped a lot with uh, my transition into defense just because you know, I've had a lot of extra time to practice with my stick and of course build up some strength, which is definitely necessary for defense. And um, I feel like it's a good way to ease me into uh, the transition and really uh, get used to defense. <laughs>